everybody, it's not too old gamer. Welcome back to Norwich Home. It's a uh, nice day on the farm, a little bit late in the evening. Just trying to uh, get some fields planted. I just finished uh, just finished harvesting them and thought I would uh, make a quick video. I've been trying to use uh, higher workers and I'm really having a lot of trouble with them with uh, with this modded plow that I downloaded. I'll put the uh, I'll put the link in the description, but um, just gonna manually clean this up a little bit. I think in this episode it's mainly gonna be planting. Um, I've got most of the fields harvested, cleaned up. Um, we just got to run around getting everybody uh, planted and fertilized. That would be good. This one, it's leaving really big swaths of, uh, of unplowed ground at the end of each row. I know I could, there's a couple ways I could address that. I thought about doing a, a course play course to just kind of run around the edges or, you know, a court, really a course play for the whole thing. Uh, there's a couple ways I could approach it, but, uh, thinking about just getting rid of this cultivator, honestly. It, um, it's not uh, not working out as well as I had hoped. This is the, uh, just to, to show it to you, this is the, those are sewing machines, that's why I'm not finding it. This is the top-down 500. Um, perfectly good cultivator, I suppose. It's just making, uh, I don't know, I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm picky. I like for it to uh, to get most of the field. The other field I'm using, the uh, Horse Toronto, it seems to be working great. I might try the uh, the Terra Disc or something like that a little later. Um, or the, the Horse Tiger, perhaps. I don't know. Gotta get a bigger tractor for that one. But anyway, right now, this is what I've got. So, uh... Finishing it up. One thing I've also thought about is limiting the size of this field. This, this downhill slope on the edge of field 37 really makes things a little complicated. Um, causes vehicles to have trouble coming back up the hill when they're loaded. It, uh, I don't know. It's just uh, one of those things that can get a little irritating if you're like me and like for things to, to mostly be uh, you know, fully used, nice and regular. So, anyway, you can see there was corn on this field before I harvested that a, a little bit ago. Didn't quite uh, get all of it, but uh, didn't didn't miss too much. It uh, didn't seem to be worth driving all the way down to uh, to get it straightened out. I set up a course play to harvest this field and take everything down to the biogas plant. Um, so I used the uh, the front mounted chopper, or corn slot, what it would be a, a cutter. Um, you can see this side of the field is where it really, I, I really have no idea what the, uh, what the hired worker AI was doing here. It uh, doesn't seem to have even gotten the field edges correct. I don't know. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is clearly a modded uh, plow. The animation is not quite lining up, but that's alright. It's better than I could do, because I have absolutely no experience with doing 3D modeling or mods. I think it'd be fun to get into, though. Maybe if I ever do that, I'll, uh, I'll do a video series on it. It might be, might be fun. Adventures in, uh, in learning how to make mods. I did download the, uh, the tutorial series, mainly so I could do uh, map editing. I haven't really played with the the vehicle models or the, uh, the equipment models, but it is there, so I might do that. That could be interesting and fun. And really that's what it's all about. If, uh, if I'm not having fun, then why am I doing this? If you're not having fun, why are you watching this? Um, there we go. So that's almost done. This is just me being picky, I suppose. Ooh, way too fast. Goodness. Alright. That have it. That seems to have mostly taken care of it. I'm sure there's some little spot somewhere in this field that I didn't quite catch, but it'll be okay. And then this field is almost done. Just uh use this to run down the edges real quick while I'm here. Definitely do not want to get into the area that he's going, the worker's going to be coming through next because I don't want to uh, mess with his next run. Cruise along. Looks like I've mostly got the, uh, the frame rate issues worked out. Uh, my graphics card was overheating quite a bit, so I've uh, resolved that, and uh, also noticed it was happening mostly when I was up near the farm and had a lot of vehicles parked, so I'm going to try to try to spread them out a little bit, I think, so I'm not trying to render so many vehicles all at once, and hopefully that'll help. Just about done with this. I'm going to pause him right there. And uh, let's walk over. We'll just run instead of tapping. I parked the truck around here somewhere. Or I may have moved it back to the farm. I don't know. I'm going to get this guy started planting. And this field's going to be corn again. Actually, no. I don't want this. Yeah, I'm going to do this field with corn. Great. While we're here. Um, these two fields, so fields 23 and 28, are planted with sugar beets. 36 and 37 are going to be corn. Um, 34, 39, 38, 29, 30, 24, and 25 will be grain crops. That's the plan right now. We'll see what happens. We've also got... Wow, I've got... Uh, that was interesting. I wonder what just happened. 
All of a sudden my frame rate went to zero. It was like the game hung. Very strange. That has not been happening recently. <laughs> Alright, I might be able to uh, help this along. Wow, something is... Thing is, I, I just said I thought I'd get my frame rate issues resolved. Maybe it's the recording software. That's interesting, because I'm I was really not seeing that kind of issue um, before I started recording. <coughs> Very interesting. I'll have to keep an eye on that. Maybe it is the recording software. I'm using OBS right now to um, to make the recordings. There are some some nice features. I like that it's free. I like uh, I like the shortcuts. I like lots of things about it. There are some things I do not like about it. I don't like that. Uh, there's no way to pause. There's no way to say I'm going to go off camera, do something, and you know be right back. You have to stop recording, um, make a new file, then you can go back, um, you know, start recording again on a second file, then go into an editor and stitch them together. It's just kind of painful when, when all you really want to do is pause, do something, and then come right back without having a uh, big gap in the recording. But, oh well, it's been requested as a feature. OBS is, uh, is open source, so um, it will be addressed whenever one of the developers decides to uh, work on it. Because that's the way it works. Alright, so all the fields are cultivated at this point, and um, working on seeding. I've got, uh, I've got those two seeded. 36 is working on seating, 37 is being seated, and then the uh, the other, uh, the, the grain seeder is uh, over on 29, I believe, and the fertilizer spreader is uh, somewhere, it's over on the other side, uh, over towards 34, 36. Actually, I noticed the, there's no longer a worker hired, so he might be done. I'll go check on him in a second. First, I'd like to uh, to get these guys parked. And I was just saying, I'm going to try to spread these out. So I think I'm going to take this guy over. Um, and we'll park him over here for the time being. I've got a couple of different things parked over here that... Um, don't get used a whole lot, either, because they, uh, in the case of the smaller cultivators, because I've got larger ones now, or in the case of the mixer wagon, um, I mixed up a whole bunch of uh, feed, and now I don't need any for a little bit. It's one of the nice things about uh, this particular map, since it's got the ability to store mixed ration, silage, all that, in these... Uh, little warehouses, you can do that. You can uh, you can make up a bunch and then not worry about it for a little bit. So that's uh, that's what's going on right now. And uh, well, not uh, not too exciting. Oh yeah. So the fertilizer is done. So I'll get him started on the next run. Um, see if he lines up correctly. That uh, looks almost right. There we go. How that worker. And uh, let's let him run for a little bit. So we're just uh, farming along, getting everything done. Maybe the next, probably the next episode will be a little more exciting, but uh, this is part of it. Just uh, just seeding everything, getting everything ready. And uh, wow, 
been doing it for uh, 20 minutes or so. So uh, I think I'll end up there. I'm just going to finish this up and uh, next episode we'll have crops growing and uh, go play with the animals a little bit. That'll be fun. See you then.